This is the spooky. This is the spooky two um, channel two channel signal generator. Um, I'm using two remote devices with two uh, uh, sets of uh, fingernail clippings in the DNA holders. And I, I don't know if you're familiar with this because this is uh, it's a good term because I think Einstein termed this correctly when he called it spooky at a distance. It seems strange, but who knows if it you know I'm going to try it out. I'm going to try it out. Uh, so anyway, um, I would think this is the best damn thing going, to tell you the truth. And, um, you know, I'm going to try doing a sweep that's in this custom program that was, uh, uh, I guess, written by or in, uh, converted to English or whatever by John White. And he actually put some of his um, sweep frequencies in there, custom for sweep frequencies. And I'm going to actually probably run all of them. Um, but I'm going to drink loads of water, uh, red tea, coconut oil. I'm going to have some coconut oil for DNA repair, for toxins, or whatever the heck it is. Because uh, if this does actually knock out microbes, you know, I might feel a little, uh, you know, wiped out or something. I don't know. But we're going to give it a shot here and uh, <laughs> way of putting it. So uh, this is, uh, you know, I looked up the word sweep. So spooky sweep one, it says it's under the custom uh, set of frequencies. Now, actually, you know, I find interesting if you can read this, it says proven up here, proven. And uh, those are pretty much, it's a pretty short list. But there's more or less uh, some pretty good stuff in there. In other words, uh, when they say proven, eh, you know, it's worth, it's worth giving it a try. I don't know if that's going to be guaranteed, but it worked for a lot of people, you know. So, I find that interesting because a lot of times with rife stuff, you don't know what the heck you're involved in uh, because, in other words, there's so much out there conflicting information, it gets confusing, you know, and I think there's various reasons why the information is confusing. The theory, I think, is sound. You know, it may not be the, the magic thing that clobbers everything, but, you know, in combination of good nutrition, maybe pharmaceutical medicines too, uh, other things, sunlight, sunlight actually cure, helps the body heal up too, right? Uh, you know, because the sun puts out various frequencies. But anyway, I'm going to try to sweep. And you know, the thing is, i got to make sure we're putting it on uh, remote. You know, as in other words, if I put it on remote, it changes the setting. Like, in other words, if you put it on, if you use a, I don't have a plasma device, I'm gonna, I'll be getting one later. I'm actually going to wait till John White puts out whatever he puts out because... I don't trust nobody, to tell you the truth. I'd rather just get it from him. But, um, you know, if you, you might have to make sure you click the right thing. This is a contact pad device. Uh, that's when you use the handhelds or you use the, the uh, you can use uh, pads through the body. Uh, in other words, um, in other words, uh, electrical contact uh, through um, cloth pads wet with saline solution so they conduct electricity on either side of the body or handhelds. But, um, since I'm using, I'm going to use remote, I don't, I'm not going to use that, I'm going to use heel. Now I noticed I was looking up about the voltage because I'm going to leave this on 9 volts to tell you the truth. Because, uh, But you can actually change this to 4 or 5 volts over here for the remote. See by default, like if you put it on uh, plasma, it goes to 5 volts, you put it on contact, it goes to 20 volts, which is the maximum amount this generator puts out. So I'm going to put it on a remote. Now I, I can actually bring this down and uh, you know put it on five volts. I'm going to leave it on nine. <laughs> I don't know, think I'm going to get too much of uh, you know. I've done so many different things with coconut oil, colloidal silver. I probably don't have too many microbes in my body. You know, that's probably we're not going to get too much of a reaction. But I'm going to drink a lot of water when I do this. So you double click on this. And it jumps down into the box here. I'm not going to email myself or anything. I think this thing is fantastic. But you notice it's going to put out two square waves on each um, channel. It's going to put out a square wave. In other words, two square waves, one on each channel. In other words, um, applying the frequencies direct. Um, now, sometimes, you know, I'm not. It, this program is freaking fantastic man i'm like flabbergasted by this damn thing but anyway this i only have one generator right now hooked up to this so i'm going to get another generator 
And I got this little laptop here because this is a Toshiba Windows uh, 7 starter. That was the original stuff this thing was, um, uh, pro you know, the program was designed with. You know, it works with Windows 8, it works with Windows 7, XP, but the original, I think they started it with Windows 7 starter, so I got a computer that was specifically, I'm using it just for this, as a matter of fact. But anyway, I got one block here because I have one device, I got two remotes hooked up, you notice the LED lights are off, they're, they're not on, on the remotes. So, when I click this on, this other screen comes up, and here's the program, it's all set, right, ready to go. Um, I don't know, man. I'm actually I'm gonna run all these sweeps to tell you the truth, but I'm gonna drink a hell of a lot of green tea, red tea, uh, a lot of water, take a lot of coconut oil because I might have a lot of toxins or from stuff getting clobbered. I'm not sure what's gonna happen to tell you the truth. Um, you know, I'm left it on the nine volts. I read that you probably should really put it on four or five volts. Depends on the person, but I left it on nine. That setting over here that's kind of grayed out. Now I'm going to hit start, and uh, you can see the LED lights are lit up. You know, it's really putting out some oomph there. You know, I noticed like if you lower the voltage, uh, you'll see these lights dim a little bit more. If you have it on four, it won't be as bright. Um, and here, this basically it applies a slightly I, you know, it's, it applies a, you know, it's a different type of frequency. It's applying directly through the remote. I don't actually understand this thing, to tell you the truth. And, uh, you know, I'm going to state this, though. The theory behind Rife Lukowski, George's Lukowski, I got that portable Lukowski coil. I, I think the theories are 100% correct. You know, I think this damn thing that was, that the spooky too. This thing is is beyond worth the money, beyond worth the money. You know, I mean, it may not, it may or may not do everything that people want it to do, but you know, I always look at it like this: if certain people have a certain problem with something, no matter what it is, it could be minor or major. It's a matter of combining different methods, and a lot of times that'll help. In other words, maybe it won't be one specific thing that is the magic you know, potion that works or whatever. I shouldn't use that word, potion. But the thing is, it's maybe a combination of things that actually works the best. So I'm going to run this sweep right now. And, um, you know, I honestly say this. Honestly, you know, we had Royal Rife in the 1930s, right? And I hear him running this sweep. It's not exactly Rife technology, but it's based upon, you know, his, his type of work. The guy actually did... Um, developed something with radio waves that actually killed um, cancer viruses and bacteria, whatever cancer is, you know. So I think it morphs between a virus and a bacteria and back and forth. But he actually did do the work correctly. It was legit. It wasn't a joke. It wasn't a, a hoax. It wasn't anything like that. But, you know, lo and behold, in the 30s during the Depression, what comes up? World War II. You know, Lukowski comes out with his device, 1931. You know, it, the book gets printed basically also about, uh, you know, the secret of life. Right at the same time, Hitler is actually invading um, Germany. That, that's when that book was printed in 1939. I think it was September. You know, it's like, um, you know, what might be coming up today, history repeats itself. Is like we might be having World War III coming up while all this great technology is coming out with uh, truly having methods to heal, prolong life, or make you feel better, or whatever the heck it is. Uh, so I'm going to tell you this. I'm putting this out here for this reason. Uh, grab the bull by the horns and go with it, man. I can actually tell people, I'm, you know, I don't sell this. I don't freaking have no financial connection to this. I'm just saying, I think this is the most fantastic idea gone. You know, I find this unbelievable that this thing can actually work from a distance with spooky, whatever. Like, in other words, using a DNA holders. But actually, this type of Rife um, setup, from my understanding, has only been around since 2011. So, it's something pretty damn new. 
you know? And the thing is, you know, say for instance, you don't like this idea about using a remote. I like it because, well, I'll see what, I don't know what the hell it's going to do to tell you the truth. I don't know because I don't have cancer or anything, you know? I suppose they had a note on my lung or something, you know, one time and they checked this and I'm like, you know, whatever. <laughs> but uh, the thing is, um, you know, when I'm looking at it like this, this device alone, say for instance, you, just using it like the pad type device, just for that reason alone, this thing is well worth the money, beyond belief, beyond belief. Yeah, so if you want to stick to the old way that you know using the pad type Rife machines, which aren't as effective as the original Rife machines, but still easy, they're not difficult to use. I highly recommend this because of the price, the price, value, value, value. So um, you know, but you know, try it out in moderation. I'm going to probably run every single one of these sweeps uh, one a day. I don't know how long you're going to take. They're probably going to take a long time, probably a lot of hours. And make sure you have your computer so it doesn't go to sleep. Like I have my computer now. I got it so it doesn't go to sleep on me because that was interrupting the program. That was one of the only things I was doing stupid. I was actually had the computer so it went into sleep mode. And uh, it caused the uh, program. You know, I got to keep this so it runs the whole time. It doesn't go into sleep mode. But... Uh, the best deal, you know, actually is to use the two remotes. Um, I have a tendency to think this thing works, to tell you the truth. I have a tendency to think it works. In my mind, um, I got a very, you know, show me type of mind, like you better freak, you know, in other words, I like to see, you know, hands on how it works and stuff, but you know, I have a tendency to think this works. Um, let me put it to you this way. My BS detector um, is on zero. In other words, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this as 100% legit all the way. That's really how I'm looking at it. You know, a lot of times my BS detector goes way full tilt and things like that. I'm actually looking at it like this, in this way that uh, I think this thing is 100% honest. You know, and the other thing is I just want to mention again, if you don't like using the idea of using these remote devices... You know, the, the word spooky is a good word for that because I, I just can't figure out how this works, you know, to tell you the truth. I mean, I read all the theories about a quantum entanglement. And I've read, I've been reading hours and hours and hours on this stuff. And I'm still like, you know, I, I can't figure this out. But I guess it's almost like, you know, let's say it does work exactly the way, you know, the theory goes. But it's almost like when a person first looks at a television set and they look at the screen and they say... You know, if they never looked at a television set in their whole life, and they say, how the heck did you get the people inside the tube? You know what I mean? Because you're displaying a picture. But, you know, maybe that's, you know. But anyway, I want to try this out, and I want to say right now, I think that this program, this thing is one of the best damn things going. Uh, I'm probably going to exceed what you're supposed to be doing, because I'm going to run every single sweep, um, you know, one, one, one day, one the other day. But at the same time, you know, if I'm actually wiping out microbes in my body, um, I'm going to be going ahead and uh, drinking a heck of a lot of water, red tea, green tea, taking a lot of, uh, you know, colloidal silver, whatever, oh, drinking ozonated water. Uh, and, and I do these things anyway. So I think, you know, I'm probably not going to have too many microbes and stuff. But I don't know. I'm kind of a little bit of a techie, so math guy, so kind of curious about this damn thing to tell you the truth and i just want to present it out here in a non-technical way if i'm not hopefully i'm making myself clear it's very very simple to use very very simple all you have to do is take some your fingernail clippings you know without the without the uh, mechanics grease on them like i work on my cars <laughs> um put them in between some masking tape and they go right between the circle where that bullseye is and in other words then the remote device is coded specifically only to my DNA, only my DNA. And so these right frequencies that are being used are only going to me specifically. And uh, I got two devices on here, so it's running on, they're running two, two channels concurrently. And it's running through a sweep, which should pretty much nail everything. 
So anyway, uh, we shall see. We shall see what happens here. And uh, I don't know. I tell you the truth, I really don't know. I don't know.